And on that note, welcome back to Alice Madness Returns. I believe last time I promised I would return with a better attitude. Well, I've returned, so <laughs> we're halfway there. Oh, fuck a banana. Okay. 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 So, we need to take out Big Scary Guy, right? I sort of figured out last time that the... Uh, oh, he's, he's launching burning heads at me. That, how lovely. How lovely that he's launching burning heads at me. You know what? I'm just going to uh, smash these because, you know, I might as well. Uh, oh, I got hit in the face. <laughs> yeah. So, my umbrella doesn't seem to work against these things. That's what I have learned. So, here's what I'm going to do. Because if he gets close to me, he bites my head off. So, we want to, like, maybe not get close to him. Where the fuck has he gone? Where's he gone? Where's he gone? I don't know. I'm scared. I'm just going to run. 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 Uh, where is he? I have literally no idea where he is. How have I lost him? He's fucking huge. Oh, there he is. <laughs> right, okay. So, run, 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 run. I ran right into that one, didn't I? Uh, I believe my best tactic is to just kind of hit him with the, uh, with the, uh, with the, with the pepper grinder. And pray. Yep, that's my current tactic. Pepper grinder and pray is what I'm going for. <laughs> and we're just, you know, we're going to see how that goes for us. I don't know if he's got like a weak spot or something. I wonder if I can like... Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Run, 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 run. Yeah, I wonder if we can like um, hit the... Th Where is he? Oh, there he is. Hit the exploding things like before he shoots them. You know what I mean? And make them like explode in his mouth or something like that. Assuming that's a mouth. Do you think that's a mouth? I don't know if that's a mouth. Oh my god, run, 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 Yeah, like, I don't even really know if I'm doing any damage to him, to be honest. But, I'm gonna pretend that I am, because it, it'll make me feel better. Uh, yeah. Yeah, whoa! Yeah, those things. I was wondering if I could, like, you know, shoot them. Ooh, fuck a bit Fuck a fur, fur, fur. I, I was gonna say fuck a duck and then I was gonna say fuck a banana and it came out as fuck a bud. Fuck a baduck. <laughs> um, um, okay. Oh my god, burning heads. Okay, okay, okay. Way more burning heads. Okay, they take out like a whole lot of my roses. I do not have infinite roses, you know. Like, I might run out of roses at some point. Oh, I got a bit close to him then. I got a bit close to him. Yeah, so I'm just kind of like, whoa, Alice, run. I'm just like kind of assuming that the pepper grinder's doing something to him but I'm not like 100% certain oh fuck 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 and he's biting my head off okay that takes down two of my roses oh man you know sometimes Alice dodges in a different direction to the direction I want her to dodge in so you know I'm gonna blame her for that more than me definitely wasn't my fault uh more burning heads, more burning heads, more burning heads. That's enough burning heads for today. I think we've got enough burning heads to be going on with, you know. I don't think we need any more burning heads, right? <laughs> okay. Okay. Whoa! Don't want two roses. Two roses. Excellent. Wonderful. Brilliant. Exactly what I wanted. Two roses. Yep. We can do this on two roses, right? He's not even looking a little bit dead, you know. Uh, ooh, fuck, 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 Yep. Just make that my catchphrase at this point, really, shouldn't we? Ooh, hang on. Yeah. Trouble is, I'm getting like no hint of whether I'm actually doing anything to him, like at all. Um. I asked Fred for tips about this, and he was like, "Yeah, they're just really hard." I was like, "Oh, okay." Uh, ooh, we've got hysteria. So we can go into like uber shooty mode or something. Pepper grinder doesn't need to recharge when we're in hysteria. So that's awesome. I need to run, 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 I need to run. Oh my god, he's terrifying. He's terrifying. Do you think that did anything to him? I don't know if that even did anything to him. I have like literally not a clue. Oh god, run, 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 he's coming for me. I don't like it when he like comes running at me. That's like really bad and I'm stuck on a rock. Jesus Christ, I'm stuck on a rock. Right, where is he? Where is he? I keep losing him, which is weird. Okay. I think he's doing, yeah, he's doing his big like uber 
thing, what he does. And then he makes quite cute little noises, you know. Uh, okay, and then he goes explodey, explodey. And I think then he's going to come at me, is he? He's going to come at me now. Oh my god, like what the fuck do I have to do? Like, ah, run, Alice, run, 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 run. <laughs> I'm really scared. I want to go home, guys. Uh, where is he? He's over there. Okay. I mean, I've got him to like the kind of... Uh, the routine. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. He's coming for me. I literally just ran right into him. Yeah, that's what I mean. Sometimes she doesn't go the way that you want her to go. I have no idea if we even managed to make a dent in him after all of that, to be honest with you. Not a frigging clue. Alright. So... Shooty, 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 shooty. Run, runny, 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 runny. He's got such horrible hands. I think he's coming at me with his hands, guys. I don't remember what difficulty we're playing on. Like, I wonder if I could pop it down a difficulty setting. Although, with games of this era, that tended to not kind of, you know, make too much. Oh, fuck, 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 too much of a difference. Um, yeah, that's two of my roses gone right there. Yeah, this was in the days before story mode, wasn't it? I love a good story mode for a boss. <laughs> a boss that you just can't get past. It. Oh, but it's story mode, it'll be fine. <laughs> you know how I was whinging about how there weren't really any proper boss battles? Yeah, I I, 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 I shouldn't have whinged. I, <laughs> I no longer want proper boss battles. Proper, like, who needs boss battles in a game, right? You don't want boss battles. What are you talking about? <laughs> I don't want a boss battle, no. Uh, I feel like this is, like, the first proper boss battle. There's been a few, say, mini boss battles. But this feels like the first proper, 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 proper boss battle. And, like, I don't even know if we're, like, even remotely getting close to doing, like, anything to him at all. Like, he doesn't... Oh, fuck. He doesn't look like he's suffering particularly, does he? Well, I mean, he looks like he's suffering, just like, you know, generally. <laughs> I feel like his, you know, existence makes him suffer. But, <laughs> but like, you know, he doesn't seem like he's suffering because of me. Okay, I think you have to kind of listen to what noises he's making. Whoa! That was a bit sneaky. Oh, blame me. All right. Managed to... Uh... <laughs> My heads explode after they've landed. Yeah, you sort of have to, like, pay attention to the noises that he's making to work out what attack he's about to do. Because you can hear his footsteps when he's coming towards you like that. But then, like, when he stops... Oh, my God, Alice, move! Move, woman! Um, to do his, like, mega attack, he does, like, a little squeak type thing. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. That's what I should have called this channel, you know. <laughs> yeah, so we're down to we're down to one rose. We've definitely been going longer than last time. I was moved. Oh dear, I accidentally ran straight into him. Yeah, yeah. We went like twice as long as last time, and I still don't think we barely touched him. Okay, guys, I'm gonna cheat. I'm gonna cheat, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the difficulty down to easy. Shh. But it doesn't make it easy. <laughs> I bet it doesn't make it even remotely easier. You know what really concerns me is that when I uh, when I messaged Fred and said, "Oh, the big scary guy who keeps trying to bite my head off, he's really got me stumped. What should I do?" and he was like, "Oh yeah, those guys are hard." And I'm like, "Those guys? You're telling me there's more than friggin' one of them?" <laughs> there's also a cat on my desk. That's really gonna help. Oh yeah, that's totally going to help because now I can't see my screen. That's really helping there, buddy. Yeah, you're doing good work here. You're doing good work helping me with this boss. Why have you got cobwebs on your face? Okay, got rid of the cat. <laughs> Ooh, where are you? Where are you? Where? Oh, fuck, where is he? Why do I keep losing him? I don't, I don't like the way I keep losing him. Oh, there he is. Okay. Yes, I know. Roll, roll, roll. Burning heads, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Just your average Tuesday. I keep shooting at me. The thing is, sometimes my thingy... Oh, fuck. My, uh, move Alice, oh dear. My, um, yes. Mm-hmm, Hoojima, what's it? Amy thing. Mm-hmm, that thing. Crosshair, that's the word. Goes orange when I'm shooting at him. 
and sometimes it doesn't it stays blue and I don't know if that I don't know if that's just like a quirk of the game that it just sometimes doesn't go orange or if there's times where he's vulnerable and times when he's not I don't know easy mode didn't make it easier guys <laughs> no I would not like to continue piss <laughs> Oh, I think story mode is the best thing about modern day games, you know. Because when you get a boss like this, you can just kind of go, no, fuck you. I just, I can't be asked. <laughs> I'm afraid, I'm afraid to say I'm that kind of gamer. That, that when I, when I encounter a boss like this, I don't relish the challenge. I'm just kind of like, oh, can we just kind of get past it, please? Um. <laughs> uh, right, okay, okay. Yeah, and the annoying thing is, like, I don't even know if I'm doing anything to him. Really? Oh, he's coming for me. Right. The trouble is when you... Oh, for fuck's sake. When you dodge, sometimes you just kind of end up dodging towards him absolutely regardless of what direction you're fucking pointing her in. Oh, I'm getting pissed off, can you tell? That console commands for this game, then. <laughs> They're a nice kill-all command or something like that. <laughs> Do love a good kill-all command. I think I need to try and be a bit more precise with my dodging rather than just randomly dodging her. Uh, right, are you, are you going shooty shooty? No, you're coming for me again. Oh my god, that's like five times in a row he's coming for me instead of shooting at me. Like, stop coming for me, mate. I know I'm pretty and everything, but how are Oh! 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 What's happening? What's happening? Is he dying? Please tell me he's dying. That did not look like he died. That looked like he disappeared. Are we gonna, are we gonna fight him again later? Okay. Did we survive? Guys, did we survive? Did we do it? I'm so pleased because, you know what? I was this close to, to hmm, packing this series in. <laughs> I, was like, I was like, you're pushing your lucky again. <laughs> oh, I hate really horrible tanky bosses like that. I don't mind, like, boss battles where there's a bit of, like, you know, tactics involved and you have to be a bit clever. Uh, I hit F5 there to uh, quick save and I don't have a save at all. Uh, so that's from playing Dragon Age, that is. Um, yeah, I don't mind like when there's like, you know, tactics and you have to be a bit clever. But when it's just like, oh, you just have to, you know, dodge a lot and fire a lot. And it's just kind of like, oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> it's not fun, is it? It's not entertaining. It's just irritating. Right. I said I would come back with a better attitude. I have a better attitude. I promise. I promise I do have a better attitude. That. That. Oh, dear. Now, there were fish people like that in the town, weren't they? And they had legs with, like, trousers and, and they were very nicely, uh, you know, put together. And he looks a bit dead. Oh. 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 Oh, dear. Oh, yes, those are definitely the fish people. The fish people seem censured. I can hear a piggy. I can definitely hear a piggy. Should we go in a little mode? Ooh, I can see a piggy. Is that an invisible piggy? Oh my goodness, do we have invisible piggies now? Is that an invisible piggy that I have to shoot? I have to shoot invisible piggies. Just when I thought this game could not get weird. <laughs> not only are there flying pig snouts, there are invisible flying pig snouts. Because not of course there are. Apparently there's a flower. Ooh, would the flower be through here? Oh, we've got this, but yeah, they disappear so much quicker than they used to. I'm sure they do. Uh, oh, we have to shoot a thing. I hope this isn't the actual way to go, because there were other things that I've missed. What did that do? What did that do? What did that? Oh, there were chests over there that I missed. Uh huh. Ooh, there's a platform. Yup. And ah uh, ha 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 ha, there's a snail. Everybody loves a snail. There's no time to waste. There's no time at all. To... Oh, we do know another one of these. Kill or be killed, okay. Oh, it's teapot people. Whoa! That was not the thing I meant to get out. Oh god, it's giant friggin' <sighs> ink people. Now that said kill or be killed. Now last time I just had to survive. But this time I might actually have to uh defeat them all. Which is going to be annoying. There we go. And oh, that was the wrong thing. Uh, I'm going to keep hitting him with it anyway. <laughs> oh, I think I actually managed to get him there. I'm going to switch to my vocal blade though, because my vocal blade's better. 
the Vorpal Blade's better at. Uh, sorry, I was trying to dodge his things there. Oh, he hit the teapot. That was uh, that was convenient. Thank you, mate. Uh, oh dear, my health's getting a bit low already. Actually, <laughs> stab this idiot in the eye. Okay, that's him dealt with. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Flaming things. Uh -huh. I know. I know. What if I just shoot him with the pepper grinder until he dies? That. Ooh, hello. Um. Yeah, I've got a better arena to play him in, actually, than what I normally do. Right, you know, this is a much better arena than what I normally have to take these guys on with. Oh, God. Oh, well, we've gotten into hysteria, which is usually a good thing, fighting these guys. But then I can just get up to him, hit him with the old vocal blade. Oh, fuck, there's more. Oh, I didn't expect there to be more. I thought we were going to be done. I thought that was going to be us. Oh, this is harder than what I ex was expected it to be. Okay, okay. <laughs> I was thinking to myself, you know what, if I can just hang a hold out, go into hysteria mode, you know, oh, there's a another one as well, um, you know, we'll be fine. But, yeah, apparently not. I'd like to remind you that we're still technically on easy mode. By technically, I mean, you know, actually. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> having a good time guys not enjoying myself not enjoying myself at all do we need to paint the roads do we really need to paint the roads i mean come on we can we can have just a slightly painted roads surely whoops <laughs> okay like five attempts later and i've decided you know what who wants who wants to paint the roads i don't want to paint the roads fuck the roads why do we need the roads what's the roads ever done for us guys come on what has the roads ever done for us i don't need a rose i don't need a painted rose like who needs a painted rose no Sorry, Fred. I feel, I feel like Fred's probably going to be quite annoyed at me for not painting the rose. I feel like that's the sort of thing that would annoy Fred. But you know what? Fuck it. I don't want to paint the rose. Screw the rose! <laughs> this stupid fucking game. Grumble, grumble, grumble. Right, what, what, what sort of horrors have we got going on in here? Every picture tells a story. Sometimes we don't like the ending. Sometimes we don't understand it. Sometimes we don't understand it. Sometimes. Sometimes we don't understand it. There's a fucking... What the fuck are you? A sort of shellfish person with a saw, saw in his head. Oh, they've put the hat back on top of the saw. That's kind of cute. Eh! <laughs> a lot of dead fish people. Oh, there's a way for me to go up there, but I don't know whether that's the way I'm actually meant to go, or if that's, like, just secret things. I don't know. We have a little, uh, have a look, see, oh, is it just a ball? It's just a ball. Here's someone breathing and that's freaking me out. Is it you? Are you making noises? Are you, are you alive? Have you got a, that's a sash, I can see M, I'm scared it might say mare or something like that. Did they kill their mare? Oh, is this the fish people's mare? The fish people from the fish town where there were fish people? I miss the fish town. That was a really nice town. Why couldn't we just have stayed there? We could have just like bought a house, settled down, you know forgotten about all of this apparently <laughs> apparently that's not a thing we're allowed to do no we have to go into the horrible fish murder house of fish murder i don't know if there's any secrets in the fish murder house oh we've got two ways to go well 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 that looks like the theater through there doesn't it are we going back to the theater i don't know i don't know guys i don't know Yeah, this is the theatre. Uh, okay. Ooh. Oh, are we, are we gonna get to see the show? Oh, I wanna see the show, but there was another way to go. There was another way to go. Cause the show sounded fun. And we like, you know. Oh, as the door closed, the door's closed. Okay. I'll never find out what was up that ramp. Probably nothing important. <laughs> okay, so. Hello. We're gonna get to see the show, guys. Oh, the theater's packed. Ooh, we're gonna get to see the show. Yeah. Uh huh. Oh, this is awesome. Oh, I'm, oh, this is really cool. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the show. Still think they should have been starfish. Would have been funnier. 
bizarre show. That's quite enough of that, I think. Enough preliminaries. Here's the performance you've been waiting for. Proves I'm without prejudice and have a fine sense of humour. Sword and crown are worthless here. I invite everyone to dance. Laborers, lawyers, shirt and gown all make their little prance. This life is full of random deaths and heaps of grief and shame. So few are soothed by accident, you want someone to blame. Fire, plague and strange disease, drowned, murdered or if you please, a long fall down the basement stairs, none are expected, no one cares. I often must work very hard, sweat running down my skin. After the dance, I then must rest and the eating can begin. Time to eat. Death is the ultimate equalizer. All have the right to be eaten. <laughs> Get a knife, princess. Don't push. All will be served. So to speak. Wicked thing. Feasting while Wonderland is destroyed. I'm not the enemy you seek, Alice. I tried to hide this bit of Wonderland from that beast. Appeasement's never clean. We must all play our assigned roles. Are you a pawn or a queen? An idiot or a practiced fool? However this turns out, consider the prospect that you've been misled, Alice. Then ask, by whom? No! Who set that bloody train in motion? Where has it come from? It arrived when you arrived, and it's more horrible even than you could currently imagine. The death of a dream! Caterpillar may know how! Mm-hmm. Yep. Makes total sense. Mm-hmm. Oh, now we're back in London. Oh, God, I like London. Uh, things don't try to kill me in London. <laughs> what? Oh, the blood in my mouth tastes like bile. Where's the brute that hit me, Nanny? Nasty prats out cold. Not dead, and more's the pity. Oh, what did he want? What they all want. Money didn't earn. What were you thinking, butting into that mess? You could have been killed. Nanny, my mind's in pieces. I still have terrible visions, and I need to know. About the fire. Same as always. You need to move on, Alice. So do I. Well, at least she's not spewing that asylum nonsense. My past is dead. I killed them. I should have saved them. I should have died. Her mind was in shambles. Radcliffe thought familiar faces would bring her round. After a year, he lost interest in their inheritance, greedy sod. Still, always asking his bizarre questions. Heavy dose of madness, I'd say, but honest is never the best policy in this life. When she wasn't comatose, she gaped, eyes like pinwheels, drooled, occasionally squeaked. Never uttered a sensible sound. And like the child she was, she kept her secrets close. Gone off some lurkers, common as cockroaches. And those poor tykes are food for perverts, like the blameless ants that wasps consume or spiders feeble prey. You visited my room at Rutledge. What you were you call that? Radcliffe paid me for a bit. A woman alone sometimes does what she doesn't particularly feel like doing. As you know. Nurse Whitless said you'd fallen on hard times. I'm no drunk like her. I'm hurting no one. Hookin's not a bad life. Except for the pimps. She also said you might have my rabbit. Please, Nanny, talk about the damn fire. Never seems to help. Look, Alice, I can't give you what I don't have. Radcliffe wrote the inquest report. I'll take you to him. Besides, he's got your damn rabbit. You should remember that. All right, but Mr. Radcliffe's useless. Don't I know it? I think I'm starting to understand. I think it's it's actually kind of making a sort of sense that we're sort of in Alice's fractured and broken mind and she needs to find out what happened in the fire to sort of, you know, get closure and all of that stuff. And it's all like manifesting itself in Wonderland, possibly, maybe. And then the train is all kind of like... I kind of get it. I think I think I sort of 
I, yeah. <laughs> like, let's make it a bit more sense than what it was, I think. Possibly. So you notice how everybody else looks really weird and quirky and Alistair just looks kind of normal. She just looks like a human. And yeah, everybody else looks really weird and disfigured. Yeah. That's probably like symbolism or something, right? You're lit up. Are you somebody I should be talking to? I don't know, but you have scary eyes. <laughs> okay, I feel like we're in the posh end of London here. This definitely feels like a lot. Oh, there's a funeral going on. Hello. Oh dear. Oh, you've got creepy veils over your faces. Oh, lovely. Okay. All right. There's a funeral going on in the middle of the street. Uh, yeah, this feels like the posh end of London, right? This feels a bit fancy. Everybody's kind of in fancy clothes. The houses are a bit fancy. Little, Mr. Radcliffe. Ah, oh, you're back. I suppose you better come up. Mind the latch. Do you know what's just occurred to me? Is that she was with that doctor who was trying to make her forget, like, all of her past trauma, and now she can't remember anything, and that's what's causing her all the, like, torment, and we're having to go around and collect her memories. But that's because this guy's just spent all of that time erasing them. That's just kind of clicked with me. <laughs> it's just it's just clicked that. Has. It's like, oh, that's why she can't remember anything. Because she's not really been going to like some creepy sort of pseudo therapist type thing. Trying to like, you know, erase all of her memories. But now the fact that she can't remember what happened is like, you know, proper creeping her out. Uh, the ancient scroll is parchment. And the characters are drawn in Indian ink, which Radcliffe claims the Chinese invented eons ago by mixing soot, lamp oil, gelatin of donkey skin, and musk. He does know some remarkable things. Ooh, maybe just make shit up, Alice. Maybe that's what he does. <sighs> this is all a bit oriental, isn't it? Fred has told me that there is an oriental uh, level. <laughs> with origami people and it's some of the hardest fights in the game and I feel like that's probably what we're going into. So yay! Looking forward to that. <laughs> uh, it's a, oh, it's a nice house though, isn't it? Nice fancy carpets. Look at this. Very lovely. Very lovely. You do have my rabbit. Forgotten your manners? And what else, I wonder? You abandoned it at Rutledge Asylum, my dear. We've been over this before. In a huff as usual, oozing with attitude and accusatory flummery, I've stolen her rabbit. Ridiculous pretext. She's here about the fire again. All the mad child wants to talk about. My report found her family dead by misadventure. She won't accept it. It goes on and on about her killing memories and her need to know the truth. The alleged truth is, the fire began in the library when the cat knocked over a lamp. The blaze trapped her parents and sister upstairs. Sister Lizzie never even unlocked her door, died in her bed. The guilty cat always sets her off. She denies it, makes no sense, it can't be, etc. Agreed. And from the outset, Alice was my candidate for the pyromaniac girl had a fixation with fire. I once remarked that I thought she might have had a larger role in causing the tragedy. She suffered some sort of psychotic episode. Did I rip his head off? I wanted to. What's left of my brain will explode. Is it mad to pray for better hallucinations? <laughs> I'm fated to expire right here. <laughs> Is it mad to pray for better hallucinations? Well, that's a brilliant line. I'm going to remember that. <laughs> uh, okay. All movable all movables and effects are gone. Nothing but dust stains and the smell of tobacco. No sign of the coroner's report or my rabbit either. Damn him. Okay, so which bit is real? Is this bit real or was the other bit real? Because we're hallucinating one of the two. And whether we were hallucinating, I mean, it was a bit weird for him to have like his rabbit on my desk, right? 
on his desk even. Is that just the same thing? Yeah. So like, is this real? And we were just having an imaginary conversation with the guy who wasn't there. Or was the first bit real and now we're imagining this? I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't look as nice anymore though, does it? I might have known that wouldn't last. Uh, ooh, we can get in this room though. Mm-hmm. Yep. Ooh. Have a little explore before we go outside. Yeah, it's just a creepy empty house. Okay. So we head out the back door. It's snowing. Lovely. Door closed behind us. Yeah, okay. Oh man. <laughs> okay. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. I'm oh there's the cow with the hat on. Mm-hmm. Okay, I feel like oh what's going on over there? I feel like worlds are colliding here. I feel like London and Wonderland have now kind of like, you know, smooshed together. And we've got a kind of wonder London land. Yeah, we've got like burning mushrooms and stuff. <laughs> so confused. <laughs> Guys, I'm so confused. Uh, oh, oh, hello. Oh, that's a bit nice, isn't it? Look at that. That's pretty awesome. Wow. Okay. Okay. And there's the train. The gothic cathedral train of doom mm -hmm. back in wonderland dress why do you ruin it's corrupting all of wonderland seeking refuge from the wicked world perhaps things only look like they've gone to hell you're not that good a liar and i'm not that stupid but something a bit less calamitous would have been welcome this unmitigated disaster is your doing and it will get worse your train keeps a hellish hit. Get moving. Time waits for no one. The change has begun. The train is perfectly capable of terrifying me, Cat. You should find another job. Is there really so little hope? There's even less. And if fear paralyzes you, we are lost. Veil of Doom. Lovely. Oh, it didn't even, like, bloody give me my health back. And now I'm being attacked by ink people. Oh, man. <laughs> Oh, hang on, it has given me my health back. Oh, thank you, game. Oh, thank you, it's like you were listening. Okay, okay, can you get rid of all the enemies for me as well, please? That would be kind of really awesome. Oh my goodness, I defeated one of the big guys without having to go into hysteria mode. Well, well. Will wonders never cease? Okay, actually, can I upgrade anything yet? Anything I can upgrade? No. Hmm, I wonder what I want to upgrade when I next can. Probably the pepper grinder, to be honest, now that I know that the pepper grinder I need for the big scary guy will almost certainly be back. Um, this is a bit nice, isn't it? I quite like this. This is very atmospheric. There's London up there. Okay, hello, London. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. These rocks raining down from the sky. Excellent, lovely. Love a bit of this shit. Uh, there's a thing for me to smash. And now I'm gonna smoke something, <laughs> as you do. Why not? Why not bring drugs into the mix? Of a thousand miles begins with a single step. A single step off London Bridge could end my journey. Failure as your epitaph. Uh, I'd hoped you were more courageous. Okay, now we're contemplating suicide. Mm -hmm. Okay, excellent. I should have known that's where we were headed next. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, going a little mood. Oh, oh, there's a angry person. I'm assuming you're the caterpillar, are you? Okay. Uh, get over here. Oh, and then there's some slugs for me to bash with me bashing stick. That vaporous ledge only appears as flimsy and insubstantial as your confidence. It will hold you. Trust me. Okay, what flimsy ledge? What are you talking about? You talk about weird caterpillar man, not flimsy ledge. What this? You're talking about this? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh okay. 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 I'm a bit confused, guys. Just like a little bit. Just a little tiny bit confused, but you know, I'm enjoying the atmosphere. It's cool. I like it. Ooh, we've got a bit of a floor as lava situation going on here, I think. I'm assuming I'm not meant to stand on the red bit. That's what I'm assuming. I stood on the red bit. <laughs> Can I stand on the red bit? Does it hurt me? Uh, it doesn't seem to hurt me, actually. Okay. 
Oh, we've got more, more, more slugs to deal with. Oh, God, teapot land is colliding with uh, whatever this is. What should we call this? Sort of like hellish death land? Yeah. Yeah, there's like a lot of teapot shit going on here. There's a teapot in the middle of teapot land. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Ooh, is it a teapot I can pick up? I can pick up a teapot. Mm, pick up teapot cannon. Oh my goodness. You've just obtained the Mad Hatter Manufacturing Incorporated teapot cannon never seen before. Brand new automatic steam exhaust cap. Shoots devastating tea grenades. Clock, fake pressure, clock face pressure meter. Throw an instant teapot. <laughs> it will be a blast. Okay. Okay, the teapot cannon is only events, uh, uh, her, her, effective against groups of enemies. Uh, the longer shot is charged, the long the longer the a shot is charged, the longer the blast radius will be. Teapot cannon can be used to demolish weak surfaces at range. Ooh. Switch between pepper grinder and teapot cannon by mouse scroll up, mouse scroll down. Okay. 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 So I've got my my tea cannon. Ooh. I can tea cannon people. Ooh. And now I need to run away because they're getting a bit close. We're getting a bit close there, peeps. Uh, do a bit of stabby stabby. Thin your numbers out a little bit. And then... Boop! Oh, that's kind of awesome. I've got my very own tea cannon. Oh my goodness. Oh, I knew you'd be back, you little tosser. But you know what? I've got a tea cannon. Oh yeah. Look at me with my tea cannony goodness. Yeah, I think I missed. <laughs> All right, he's got burning heads. Okay, that's cool too. That's cool too, peeps. Yeah, mm-hmm. Ooh, what the actual fuck monkeys is going on? That, all right. <laughs> it's like a flame-based vacuum cleaner, isn't it? <laughs> Sorry, I insulted you. <laughs> You're very cool. You're very cool. Yeah, that, that seemed to wear him out a little bit. He looks a bit dead, doesn't he? <laughs> okay. Okay. Your vacuum cleaner's very cute. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> to be fair, it doesn't actually do that much damage to me. Oh my. Fu oh my fucking god. Unless you get stuck in it, of course. Then it does a lot of damage to you. Oh, we're still on easy mode, by the way, just in case you were wondering. Never bothered to turn it back up. Uh, right, okay, okay, okay. So now now he needs to have a little rest because he's worn himself out. Bless his little cotton socks. And, oh, we fired that in completely the wrong direction. That's interesting. Yeah, and then he's going to stand up again. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. <laughs> okay, yes. <laughs> Fire vacuum cleaner, uh-huh. Yep. <laughs> oh dear, you gotta laugh, aren't you? You gotta laugh, man. <laughs> uh okay. And then he's worn himself out, so T cannon. Whoop. And then I'm going to switch to the old uh, pepper grinder for a little bit. No, just pepper grinder's face in. I think it's I've upgraded the pepper grinder, that's the thing. So Oh, see if I can get it. Ooh, thing in. Oh, that went off in completely wrong direction there. Okay, okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> oh god, I think he's actually a bit less threatening like this though. Like it was definitely scarier when he was coming at me with his like you know, you know, he's trying to bite me head off thing. That was definitely way scarier. Ooh, that looked like that did something to him there. And, oh man. Sometimes it goes off in the wrong direction. I don't understand why. Alice just forgets how to shoot. Oh my god, here he comes. Here he comes with his fire vacuum clean. <laughs> vacuum clean a bar, that's what we're calling him. Oh, uh, jump, Alice. Jump, 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 jump. Oh, I've got stuck. I've got stuck. <laughs> Oh, I love the fact that he just gets really tired. That's quite cute. Um, okay, pepper grinder time. And then I think he's gonna go into yeah vacuum cleaner mode. 
He's just an entertaining boss, I suppose. Much more entertaining like this than what he was the first time. Okay, pepper grind him a little bit until we pepper grinder overheats. And then we'll go tea cannon. Boop, boop. Oh, here he comes. Here he <laughs> Bless him. Yeah, uh-huh. Vacuum cleaner. Oh my god, I keep getting stuck on him. That's the problem. Okay, trouble is if he manages to catch me again. I'm going to end up in hysteria mode, which in and of itself isn't really an issue. It's just, you know, you don't get much, many chances after hysteria mode, and I don't think hysteria mode's going to be enough to beat him, unfortunately. Uh, awesome as hysteria mode is. Uh, oh, I got stuck then. I got stuck. Okay, get ourselves a few more hits in. And then... Yeah, sometimes it just goes off in a random direction and doesn't like go like even remotely close to where you're actually aiming, which is unfortunate. Okay, it's kind of hard to sort of like, figure out exactly where he is and then you keep getting stuck on things. Now we're in hysteria mode. Okay, 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 okay. May as well just shoot at him while we're in this mode. Why not, eh? Why not? What's the worst that could possibly happen? Just keep shooting. I've got infinite... Pepper grinder. I'm assuming it's doing more damage to him as well. And it still wasn't enough. Still wasn't enough. Like, how what do you want from me, man? Still on easy mode, by the way. You know. Just in case you were wondering. Just in case that was something. Ooh, 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 ooh. Is he dead? Guys, I think we got him. I think we got him. Remember to spend your teeth. That's a weird time to remind me to spend my teeth. Like, yeah, I know. Is that because I can upgrade the tea cannon? Can I upgrade the tea cannon? That I can upgrade the tea cannon. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Ooh, I can upgrade the tea cannon. Okay, we defeated the big guy. Do you think there'll be another terrifying big guy? When do you think that'll be it? Do you think? Do you think? You know? Do you think that'll be the last one of those, or do you think we'll have to deal with vacuum cleaner man again? Who knows? I thought I heard a slug. Uh, yeah. That was exciting. We beat him, guys. We beat him. We did it. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, that's uh, delightful, isn't it? Let's just smash that. Okay. There's lots of dead ink people that I need to smash. Yeah. I feel like nobody's having a good time in this weird and wonderful new wonderland. Which is definitely bigger on the weird than the wonderful, to be honest. Oh, hello. There's a pen pen memory in that direction. I keep forgetting to go into little mode. There's teeths. Is there teeths? Oh, no, there was teeths up there. All right. And then there's caterpillar guy. Is that supposed to be me having a mental breakdown? So to be fair, that does look like what I look like when I'm having a mental breakdown. <laughs> um, um, and then, was there something over there? Oh, no teeths. That's all right. I knew about them. Yeah, okay. Oh, and there's slugs, obviously. Hello, little slugs. Catastrophe may strike even the best regulated families. Of course, one family's disaster may be another family's opportunity. And the same goes for a surviving family member. Okay, so, I don't think there's any more secrets around here, is there? No. So we'll head up here. I feel like we're getting to a bit of an end game. Feels like we're getting to a bit of an end game, doesn't it? But then I've been told there's a Red Queen level. So, you know. Maybe we uh we need to deal with the Red Queen level first. <laughs> that guy's just gonna get killed by his mate over there. Oh my goodness, that's the second one of those guys I've managed to get down without using mania. My health isn't even that low, guys. I'm getting good! I'm getting good, I'm getting better. Yeah. Bad guys in that direction. There's bad guys in every direction game. I think, you know, you can stop telling me about the bad guys. I'm sort of generally aware that bad guys are a thing that exist. <laughs> oh, blimey. What's going on here? Oh, there's a piggy snout. Stop everything. There's a piggy snout needs a pepper in. Get secret paths open for us. The music's very stressy. Like, 
I mean, I feel like the music needs to chill out a bit. It's like, you know, I know everything's awful and, and we're all dying and all that kind of stuff, but just, you know, take just chill out. Just take a minute, take a chill pill. There's a Cheshire cat over here, apparently. Uh, oh, 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 is that, do I need to use the, uh, the tea cannon for that one? Maybe I do. The music's going really, really mental, like it thinks something's attacking me, but like nothing is attacking me. So I wondered if I might be able to kill all the enemies before, like, you know, I could destroy the things, but then there's like no enemies. So I don't know. Well, I mean, here's some enemies. Maybe these are the enemies I have to kill. Who knows? Ah, oh, the lava is hurting me. I thought it would. Oh, there we go. There we go. The music's calmed down now. The music's gone all calm. And now I can destroy the things. There we go. And smashy, smashy, and we can get the keyhole. There we go. We've got it. We've got. We've got a fluor. Do like a good flu. We've got another snail. Oh, do I get a second chance to uh, paint the rose? Hmm, who knows? Either that or there's a second rose to paint. Dee -dee -dee. Is it over here? Because I only needed one more, didn't I? Maybe you're allowed to fail one. Oh, Alice, we do need this. We welcome the arrival of a phantom at sunset, only to bring its departure at sunrise. What is it? Mayflies, hope, night flocks, dreams. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> we welcome the arrival of a phantom at sunset, only to bring its departure at sunrise. It's not going to be hope, is it? You don't have hope at sunset. Hope doesn't depart at sunrise. That's doesn't make sense. Mayflies doesn't make sense. I don't know what night flux is, to be honest. Could be dreams. Since night flux is the one that I don't know what it is, that's probably what, which one it's going to be, innit? It could be dreams, I suppose. Should go with that one. Are you pretending to be dense? Oh, I was wrong. I was wrong. Oh, he's giving me another one. Okay. What warms like the summer sun and heats like a blazing fire but does not burn? Spring rolls of seven stone, molten lava, blood. I mean, molten lava definitely burns. And the rest of them don't make any sense. Like a spring rose doesn't warm like the sun or heat like a blazing fire. Oh, blood, maybe. Blood? Yeah, that probably made sense. Okay. Well, he gave me some paint, so... Okay. Painted the rose, I've painted the rose. Do I get extra health? Oh. Okay. What the fuck, man? <laughs> what the fuck? It was probably dreams, wasn't it, the first one? Well, I don't know if that, like, made, like, loads of sense. Maybe made like a bit of sense. I don't know. We're gonna uh, we're gonna just fling ourselves into space. I wanted to see if I could make it over there, but I couldn't. So uh, it's all right because the game put me back over here. So you know, yeah, it all works out in the end. But I'm so confused. I'm so confused. I'm enjoying it a lot more than last time, though. I'm not like I'm not I'm not miserable and grumpy in this particular part. So now that's something. Okay, so we will head into the lava section. Uh, smash ourselves with boxes. Yeah, this seems to be like a collision of worlds here because we've got like snails and stuff from like the, you know, the Wonderlandy bit, and then we've got like boxes from the Hatters bit, and then we've got like you know teapots and just, just like bits from all of the different worlds seem to be here, and also drugs. We have drugs. get any words of wisdom this time. Well, well, well. Uh, okay. Uh, boop. Oh, and we've got floaty people. Hello, floaty people. You're quite cute. I quite like you guys. I mean, I know you spit fire and stuff, but, you know, you're actually quite cute. Yeah, and quite easy to kill. 
Try personally find a good combination. Oh, I thought I could hear another one. I thought I could hear another one. This teapot can in at range to break the wall. What wall? Oh, that wall. Oop. Yeah, we broke the wall. Go us. Go us. Um, but there's other shit over here yet, man. Yeah, there's a bottle that I needed to get, you see? Never miss a bottle. Right. Except that bottle that I missed because I was in a bad mood. We missed that bottle. <laughs> Apart from that bottle, try never to miss a bottle. <laughs> um, okay. Lift's going to take us up. Yeah, this is like back in sort of Mad Hatter bit, isn't it? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, God, we've got teapot people. Hello, teapot people. Oh, I can smash their shields now. Now that I've got my hobby horse. Oh, that's exciting. Yeah. Teapot people don't scare me anymore. Okay, so we've arrived in chess land now. Which is cool. Yeah, a little bit of chess land. Um, we've got a big scary guy, but you know what? These guys don't scare me anymore. Oh, for fuck's sake. Um, except when, you know, they've got little, little helpers helping them out. Oh, he's got floating squid people as well. Damn you with your floating squid people. Oh, hang on. I've had to go into hysteria mode. Oh, man. I was doing so well. I was doing so well. There we go. See? We were really close to killing him. I had to resort to the old hysteria. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, right, yeah. So we're now in, like, possible chess land. But who knows for sure, to be fair. Who knows? We could be. We could be anywhere. We could be anywhere. Oh, and there's... There's like half crying face. Yeah, this is like worlds colliding, isn't it? And we've got bits of a train. Oh man, all sorts of horrors going on here, man. I saw some roses so that my screen isn't all cracked. That's the main reason. Annoying when my screen's cracked, I can't see everything properly. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay, grumpy caterpillar man is that way, but so is like death and stuff, so yeah. <laughs> Yeah, there's a caterpillar, but there's also death. You know, what are you going to do? And there's a, there's a squid person. Hello, squid person. Uh, where are you, squid person? Oh, you're really high up. Oh, and now we've got the mechanical hands from... Uh, uh, yes, the, uh, the corporate hell. Yeah, we just seem to be going through all of the... Uh, all of the... Uh, oh, you landed down there, did you? Oh, I'll come and give you a whack, don't you worry. Uh, oh, you survived, man. You weren't going to do that. Yeah, it's like all of the worlds are coming together. In a big happy reunion or something like that, probably. Maybe, maybe it'll be a happy reunion. I don't know. Right, uh, we've got hit pads. So, where are they? Oh, God, they disappear so quickly. And boop. Yeah, and then get onto here. And get onto there. I've got this, man. I've got this. Oh, I found a thing to shoot. All right. And then I'm gonna get things. Yes. <laughs> Don't know what they were for a minute. Okay. I'm just gonna get me over to here. Get me an exciting, sexy memory. I've smoked a cigarette, Alice. No fun at all. One day I'll try a clay pipe. <laughs> um, I'm assuming that's her sister. Yeah, Lizzie. Uh, right, okay. Now we need... Ooh, there's a basket over there. Yeah. Need to head over here and I'm a bit concerned. Because there was a, a, a drawing on the side of this cliff, I think it was. Oh, Chesh wants a word. Chesh! The sight, the stink, the sinister sound. What have you imagined, Alice? I don't know what I've imagined. Probably scary things, knowing me. Yeah, was it on the side of here? Yeah! That there looks like one of the big terrifying people that I've already killed twice today. I don't like the big terrifying people that I've already killed twice today. I don't want to fight another one. They're not fun. Alright? There are some bosses that are fun. Those ones, not fun. Don't enjoy them. I think I've got enough teeth to um, upgrade some stuff now, though. 
So maybe we'll have a bit of an upgrade before we head through there. Should we do that? Yeah. Do we want to upgrade tea cannon or pepper grinder? Ooh. Ooh, the choice. I think pepper grinder, because I think the pepper grinder is actually more useful against those guys than the tea cannon. So we'll upgrade the pepper. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, look at me. Sexy, sexy pepper grinder. Now I've got three teeth. Have a look at my pepper grinder. Oh yeah, it's flaming. It's got flaming eyes. It's a flaming eye pepper grinder. Oh man. Mate, really? Alright. Alright. Okay. Oh, and you've got like friends as well. Have you? Well, that's just just not fair. You're not supposed to have friends. Okay. Oh, you've got squid friends as well. Like, how it? You've got multiple squid friends. Like, come on. Who needs multiple squid friends? They're just being greedy at this point. Okay, I've taken care of his multiple squid friends. Oh my god. Yeah, alright. Alright, alright. Do you know what I've just realised? Right at the beginning of the game, when we were in the asylum -y place, which wasn't an asylum, but kind of was, there was um, creepy dolls, wasn't there? And these guys kind of look like them. And, uh, yeah. Maybe, uh... Maybe we were getting hints to Wonderland, even back then, because I think it is meant to be like Alice's damaged mind, and now I get my head bitten off. <sighs> um, like, I think that's what's meant to be going on here. That we're inside Alice's fractured mind. I don't think Wonderland is a real place, because I was starting to think, like, oh, maybe Wonderland's actually a real place. Maybe that's a thing, but now I'm not so sure. Uh, yeah. You're coming for me, are you? Yeah, you're coming for me. I've got more space to fight this one, though. I think we'll ever have to fight two at once. That would be awful, wouldn't it? <laughs> Imagine if we ever have to fight two at once. I would cry. I would just cry. I think he's actually stuck. I think he's stuck and he can't get to me. And he's just going to stay there forever. That would be amazing if that's a thing that's going to happen. He's just going to stay there forever. I would be totally for that. I'd be all for that. I'd be quite happy for that to be a thing. That he's just going to stay there just forever. Just unable to get to me. Just stuck on a rock. That would that would do me. I'd be happy with that. Just keep shooting him with me demon pepper grinder. Yeah, I might switch to the old uh, tea cannon just for a bit of fun. Just for the lols, you know what I mean? That did not reach him. I might have to get close to him. I don't want to get close to him in case he moves. See? I don't want to do that. He might move. And then he might not be stuck anymore, because I really do think he's just stuck on that rock. <laughs> oh my god, guys, this is how we defeat them. This is how we do it. This is how we win. So just to give you an idea of how stupidly overpowered this idiot is, I have been doing this for 15 minutes. That is not an exaggeration. He can't get to me. I just keep shooting him. He's got me with a few of his heads. Yeah, like that. He keeps getting me like that, which is unfortunate. Um... But yeah, 15 minutes. Oh, 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 you're going down, mate. You're going down? Oh, was that you doing your mega attack? Oh, that was you doing your mega attack. Still not going down. 15 minutes I've been doing this now. Like, how is this a fun boss? Like, come on, guys. <laughs> uh, don't try and tell me it would be more fun if you could actually reach here, because it wouldn't. I mean, 15 minutes. 15 minutes of my life doing this and he's still not fucking dead I mean am I hitting him I look like he looks like I'm hitting him doesn't it I know the cursor hasn't gone orange it's just on blue but like come on it looks like I'm hitting him that was a head that narrowly missed me I mean there's like ink coming out of him so I must be hitting him 20 minutes now guys 24 minutes of this shit <sighs> Like, how it? Come on, man. Like, what do you want from me, game? What do you want from me? What? what just what? 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 What am I meant to do? You tell me what I'm meant to do, game, eh? Oh, there we are. We're in hysteria. I'll switch to pepper grindy mode. This doesn't fucking get him. Nothing fucking will. Like, I don't know if the game's glitched or something and if I'm actually just not hitting him. Just the fact that he's stuck there. I don't know if it's made the game go a bit funny or what. But like 20 minutes of this and he's not dead like there's got to be something gone wrong somewhere along the line and I'm, I'm gonna die soon that's the thing sometimes it goes orange 
but then a lot of the time it isn't orange. I don't know whether that makes a difference. I'm dead now anyway. Uh, would you like to continue? No, I would not like to continue. We're going to call it a day. We're going to call it a day. We started the episode with one of them. We're ending the episode with one of them. Only we didn't manage to defeat it. Yeah, that was mental though. I must have not been hitting it, but I was hitting it. Like you could hear that it was hitting it. There was bloody ink coming out of him. I don't understand. I don't understand, guys. I don't understand. But I'm going to leave you with the, um, the, the starting screen because that's what we've got. And I'm going to come back next time and we're going to see easy mode. I want to just, you know, remind you, easy mode. Let's see if we can defeat that guy on easy mode. They better not become a regular occurrence because I swear to God, I'm going to end up throwing my computer out the window, I think.